Hi everyone! In the vast majority of cases, Baroque and even some early classical scores lack dynamics, expression, articulation and even tempo markings. Without such directions, performers were simply expected to know an appropriate tempo and expected to shape the work as they wished. The lack of markings perhaps also reflects the improvisational aspect of much Baroque performance practice as it gives the performer more scope for interpretation. If you own or use a Baroque score which looks like this, unless you're absolutely certain that any markings are authentic, be aware that most or all are editorial, typically made either by an editor, musicologist, theorist or a famous musician, and are not what the composer wrote. Any markings whose authenticity is questionable, therefore, can perhaps be taken as suggested performance tips or simply ignored. Many of the over-edited editions are older and have increasingly been superseded by scores such as this, which indicate in brackets or as faded notes and words any editorial markings, or this score, which details any additions. I hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching. See you next time.